doesn't it behove us to throw away the Constitution? And people will literally go, yes, it does, Liz, it does behove us. It's just, it's just incredible. Oh, I don't say this lightly. You are two-faced. You are absolutely two Maybe even more faces when I think about it. There's layers. Um, you're a deceiver, Liz, and I never thought I would say that about you. Um, I would rather have a voice being heard that is swearing a lot, but is honest and trustworthy, than someone who is ever so lovely, but would absolutely go behind the people's back in the worst possible way. Uh, I'd rather have someone honest and trustworthy any day. Authenticity, Liz. You, you're not authentic. You're a good actress, though. I'll, I'll definitely give you that. <clears throat> you are lying through your teeth and you're not stopping. You're just escalating. About me, Lisa, Hannah, Calvin, and, and, and others. And they're very low attacks. They are absolute defamation. But you've done it without swearing. You've done it by looking down and looking, I really don't want to say. Yeah, Liz, you know, no one has done anything to you here, apart from saying that we don't like the fact that you deregistered New Zealand Law without consulting the members. You know, we don't think that's right. And we said so out loud, which he didn't like very much. Uh, as he said in his video the other day, people are our biggest asset in this fight. And New Zealand Law was the People's Party. And obviously, he was right when he said that. Um, he explained how he resigned as, when he was the leader of a political party a while ago when it started to go in a different direction than what he, you know, could align himself with. Um, and he knows that it's wrong to overthrow the will of the people, so he stepped aside. Um, yeah, I, I'm pretty sure, I think there's like basically on page one of um, Democracy for Dummies, uh, there were previous candidates there, you know, really solid, stable people that all served you, that spoke eloquently and they were full of conviction, um, you know, speaking about how, how they were disgusted, uh, that, you, you know, how dare you think that you could do this, you know, like you owned the party and, um, and then just disappear without any transparency over what happened and with the money in your pocket, basically. And Calvin never accused you of anything untrue in that regard because you did slip out the back door with many tens of thousands in your pocket uh, there's lots more raised this year so you know I can speak to how people would hand you money frequently um, I, I've been with you when people have just handed you envelopes wads of money and you oh thank you and you just hand it to Tim and it would just go in your handbag look at Billy Tikahika um, Somebody spoke up about the $10,000 donation they made and uh, he's currently serving 200 hours community service.